I recently had a royalty that was located at Lux Studio, which is our studio, and I want to share with you guys how I decorated for the royalty this year, just in case you guys may be interested in doing something like this in your community. Now, the colors that I chose this year were peach and cream. I absolutely love these colors. I wanted to add a little bit of mint green, but I could not find exactly what I was looking for. So I stuck with the peach and cream and the bling gold accent, uh, accent pieces that I absolutely love. These are from Totally Dazzled. And so I wanted to do some a little bling on the back of each uh, chair band. And I added these little bling um, brooches. And oh my goodness, it was like absolutely amazing. It definitely took them to the next level. And I will share with you guys how it turned out on every single chair. Now, I will tell you that my uh, type A personality got the best of me because Initially, I was going to use these stretch white chair covers, but because I had entitled this a peach and cream tea, I eventually went back and changed all of the chair color <laughs> covers from white to cream. So this is how the bling looks on each of the um, bands. I absolutely love, 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 love the way that these turned out. And if you guys are interested in getting some bling to add to your chair bands or accenting your next uh, project, I will leave the link down below. In keeping with the bling theme, I decided to do little princess gift bags for all of the princess. And I was able to incorporate that mint greenish color that I was looking for along with the peach. And then I just added these little crown sliders onto the bags. It looks so great. And I just kind of showed you guys how it looks set up at the table. I actually did use real china for this particular tea party because I was teaching the girls etiquette. But if you're not interested in using real china, you can definitely use this faux china from um, Posh Party Supplies. I will leave that link down below as well. And the crown slide book, uh, the sliders, um, I got those from totallydazzle.com as well, along with this gorgeous napkin ring. And the crown sliders actually came in two different kinds. You can slide them on like a buckle or you can slide them on to your gift or whatever the case may be. But I absolutely love the way that those turned out. So here is the first one that I have on this bag. I actually alternated them so that the girls would not, you know, be um, concerned about who got which one. And here is the second one. Um, it looks more like a tear. Yeah, the first one looks kind of more like a crown. Yeah, I'm a pageant girl, so it's a little bit of a difference. <laughs> but I absolutely love these. And you know what? You can actually work these into your floral arrangement as well. Like if you added some floral wire, you could actually work these into your arrangements. I actually thought about it after the fact, but that would have been so absolutely gorgeous there as well. So I absolutely love the way that these turned together, uh, turned out all together. Um, again, you can get the faux ones from Posh Party Supplies. I use everything real because I wanted to teach the, guy, uh, the little girls the importance of how to use everything, you know, in real life, like every day if they went out to dinner, etc. So the napkin rings, as you can see, match the chair covers. They were all from totallydazzled.com. And then the girls also did Queenly Confessions. Um, I wanted them to have these to take home with them every day to confess over their lives. And it basically says, I'm the daughter of the most high king. I'm glorious. I'm beautiful. I'm noble. I'm surrounded with gladness. It's all these positive um, affirmations and confessions that they can make over their life and over themselves every day as they're preparing to go to school or just in everyday life. So here is the overview of the room. I absolutely love the way that everything turned out. It was so absolutely gorgeous and it was so much fun seeing the girls walk into the room and you know it's just so fun for me to see their faces. Of course the desserts were done by Rachel over at Hot Mama's Bakery. Oh my gosh she did such an amazing job with the treats. The girls were so excited. They were able to pick um, at least two treats from the table and take them home as a part of their goodie bag. So thank you so much, Rachel, for such amazing desserts. And I'm telling you guys, I had so much going on this particular week. So Rachel really came through on putting everything together with the dessert table. I really did not have the time to send her inspirational pictures. 
And the crown that I just showed you guys, that is a tree topper, a Christmas tree topper from Hobby Lobby. I purchased it at 90% off. Yes. So the cake here is fake. So we've been doing um, faux cakes a little bit more because it, number one, cuts down on the budget. And number two, it allows um, us to be able to get things done a little bit ahead of time and get above uh, ahead of the schedule. So here is the crown topper that I was telling you guys about. I got it at 90% off and of course that was an amazing deal now i love the little crowns and teacups oh my gosh the cookies were absolutely amazing so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed seeing how we did our 2018 princess tea if you're interested in doing a peaches and cream princess tea definitely definitely look down in the comments below or the description box below and i'll give you guys kind of an outline of what we did we did queenly confessions we did excellent etiquettes and the girls receive training on um, how to conduct themselves as a away from the table and at the table we also did delightful dining we did a royal um, egg hunt and we did um, excellent etiquette and they learn how to curtsy they learn how to properly stand how to cut their food they learn so many things how to introduce themselves how to have queenly conversations we also had a um, preliminary winner for the Miss Alabama to come in a Miss Alabama pageant to come in and read books to them it was such an amazing time you guys thank you so much uh, Sharonda for the gorgeous 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 centerpieces oh my gosh she designed those centerpieces and and I think her out-of-pocket cost was like $16. So she did such an amazing job. Here is all the girls again with um, the queen before she was reading to them. I thought it was so cute. And the girls certainly enjoyed having the queen in to read a book to them. It was such an amazing time. It was so funny because one of the girls, um, as the queen was leaving, they, was, they asked her where her castle was and she had the greatest comeback story. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Video, please click subscribe if you're not already an official member of the Lux for Less family and be sure to follow me on Instagram and on Facebook. I'm always making new updates and until next time, it's Melanie with Living Luxuriously for Less. Cheers!